My goodness. Good thing the race cars wasn't in the, the little garage. It's definitely went down a good bit though. Yeah. From that picture that, yeah, hey, the there's a boat. All right, y'all, I think we have survived the worst of Hurricane Sally here in Milton, Florida. The storm came on shore as a pretty strong Category 2 hurricane around 6 a.m. Wednesday morning. It's now about 9.30, um, and the uh, the worst of it has passed through. But we still got uh, a little bit of it hanging around. It's going to rain and be windy like this for quite a while. A lot of rain, a lot of wind. And uh, keep in mind, this isn't the worst of it. The worst of it came through about three or four hours ago. But everything held on. I didn't check in with everyone else. No uh, preliminary observations. I think everyone's good. The roof is still on the house and garage. The trailer is still upright. Remember, we put Jesse's car in there uh, before the storm. And we got the two capital race cars in the garage. Got a little bit of debris here in the back. Some limbs there and then all scattered limbs everywhere. Um, but all things considered, not too bad. They said uh, Pensacola, uh, which is about 15, 20 miles west of us, um, got about upwards of 30 inches of rain and it's still raining. And then you got the storm surge to deal with. Uh, the storm hit, uh, came on shore at Orange Beach, Gulf Shores, that area. So the beaches down there are gonna be, I'm sure gonna have issues. Check out in here. Everything looks good. By the way, this is um, this is Shadow's rain jacket, so y'all don't laugh at my, my monogram. Anyway, we got had everything uh, kind of shoved in here. Jesse's car's out in the trailer. Uh, we'll check out there in a minute. I know, um, looks like everything's pretty good, but I know we're going to have some water over here in the floor. All right, so uh, this is going to be from the back door. I've always had an issue. I should have put out some, put out some sandbags up against that back door, but water gets in underneath it so we'll have to sweep that water out that's not a problem anyway everything's good in here let's go let's go look in the trailer there's a light over here somewhere there we go all right i think i think we fared okay all things considered but anyway like if y'all saw our video um before the storm we put jesse's car in here a lot of y'all were asking why not put all three in the garage uh, there wasn't enough room for that i mean we could have made it happen but then everything else would have been out here and we felt like putting jesse's car in here would be a better chance of making sure we uh we held the trailer down so that was part of the theory on that right about now i think they said it'll be a category one well up into uh alabama and for several more hours it, it, it makes its way north and east this is about a half mile south of our house. We live up on the hill, thankfully, but that's, um, that is the creek. There's a bridge about 200 yards down there, and that is the creek that has exceeded its banks. Anyway, Joseph has been without power since um, about five or six o'clock this morning. So we're gonna go over there and take him some more generator gas. We have power, thankfully. I think we're the only ones out of the whole bunch you really didn't lose power also uh saw where Bo saw a picture uh Bo's wife caitlin sent uh to kayla their house looks like they are uh they got flooded so get over here joseph's we might try to get out there and see if there's anything we can do to help right here in milton the highest uh recorded wind gust was um i think just over 70 miles an hour like 74 mile an hour and they said we got two foot of rain last night um so you can obviously sleep with the water back there and limbs down I hadn't seen any big trees down yet but i haven't ventured very far either no gas what do you do when the light's out treat it as a four-way stop Or not and when it's blinking caution light you treat it as a caution light did y'all survive sally made it through all right hey i got you some uh gas regenerator and some uh extension cords 
So thank you. Yeah. Because we have power. We got to I think we're. On. Yeah, we're one of the uh, the lucky few who didn't lose and power. We didn't lose it till like six o'clock this morning. Yeah. Like all night last night. Well, the it didn't uh, it didn't hit till six. So that might explain it. <laughs> all right. Hey, Whoa! Yeah, only thing we can see is that piece of vinyl right up there above the attic. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh well, everything else is intact. Did y'all survive? Your hair, your hair's windblown. Yeah. <laughs> or, or slip on. <laughs> Man, looks like your neighbors over there got the worst of it. <laughs> I'm realizing your neighbors, they got limbs and stuff down. You don't, cause you don't have any trees. <laughs> I got I got a few of their limbs. Yeah. Oh, the backyard all right too. Yeah. About the same. Uh, yeah. It was, it was a river flowing across there. You should have seen it. Probably go to work tomorrow. Yeah. If you can get the, if the roads are passable. Yeah. Well, Joseph survived. Yeah. Are hey, you ready? ready? You got your saw. I'm, I'm ready. Load it up. <laughs> We're loading the boat and the boat. They're underwater. Uh, <laughs> Y'all fair all right? Uh, yeah. Few limbs. Nothing oh, major. Well, All right, let's go. We got, I got my, I got my water boots. I said we bring anything. You said if you got any cold beer, bring it. But Arby's and Burger Cream held on. <laughs> That's always a good thing. We're getting the water over here. That is the river. Yep. I bet you. Oh, that's the river. That's the yeah. river. Blackwater River is right up here on the bridge. It's high. Yeah. Anyway, there's the roof. Whatever kind of roof that is. Yeah. The good news is they're building in the process of building a new courthouse. So. Yeah. process might have just got sped up well blackwater river oh that mercy she's looking mean railroad Ooh. look at them boats <laughs> the railroad tracks about underwater mm-hmm white capping out there my word yep. ain't going down river road today unless you're in a boat anybody want to buy some land <laughs> <laughs> Subject to flooding. Yeah. On this side. Yeah, there's still. Yeah. Ah. These are bows. This uh, road was underwater earlier. That bow's excavator? Yeah. Well, I guess we just throw them in the truck. These are all mobile home tires. All right, so the water washed over this road, and Bo ha these are mobile home tires from Bo's place, the mobile home guy. Yeah, yeah. How far did those wash? good 200 yards yeah. hell no other side of the shop probably 300 all right well we'll return them to where they belong yeah what a mess what a mess indeed so the water road was underwater yeah <sighs> and this is both shop they was a couple inches in the floor to show you see the water line right up above. yep yep his car was not in here <laughs> uh where are we dropping these off? Pile uh, yep. there, that's the bay right or the... It. Well, it ain't, it's not that close. It's, it's just it's up. It's usually way out there, but yeah, yep. that's it. That's wow. the Blackwater River right there. Dang it. That's the river that we came over in town. Uh -huh. Well, bay's off of it, I guess. Yeah, that's cute. <laughs> I think they would look good if you kept her rain jacket on too. Yeah, with the monogram. That was that monogram. Where's your house in relation? Right back there. Okay. Right there. You just gotta, gotta go around. I got you back on the highway. There's water between here and your house at the moment. Yeah. Mm. Uh, one more load though. So, sorry for the confusion. We basically just showed up and got to work. This was all underwater this morning. Y'all yeah. pulled this one out of the water? Water was about this high. 
opened the doors, it just poured out. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, man. How much water do you have in your house? Uh, about a foot and a half. And the building wasn't but a few inches? A few inches. Just enough to make a mess there. Yeah. We had some deep logs where Ricky Gilmore showed up with his roll bag. We're out here pouring down, you know, 100 mile an hour wind. We're mm. loading cars up on the back of the roll bag. Uh-uh-uh. Couldn't -uh. tell how high it was going to get. Right. Well, high tide wasn't the plus block. So the water's still, the road's blocked down there. People are trying to get through. They're going through it. I'm thinking it's coming down and I see it didn't get up. Yeah. When did it get on Tommy? I woke up at uh, 7.30 this morning and the water was through the tank down there and I knew we were in trouble. So I They're going crazy. There. Did y'all fare all right? This ain't got no um, power. Yeah, we, we didn't even lose power at our house. We got Generax running. Yeah. Remember, remember how after Ivan, how it kind of like looked like just a bunch of limbs all over? Mm -hmm. That did not happen until after daylight this morning. Yeah, yeah, our, my yeah weird. my yard got worse after I got up and yeah. saw it. I got two boats in my yard. Oh no, man. That aren't yours. <laughs> Golly. No gusting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Oops. 8, 500. laughs> Hanging out with y'all is a lot more fun when we're not fishing trash out of the ditch. Yeah, I'd much rather be at the racetrack or something, huh? <sighs> Perfectly good guess. Yeah, I bet. What is that? For the it's lifting power line? Yeah. And a tire fishing pole. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. That's how he was getting out of the uh. All right, last load of tires. So what happened? I don't know if y'all can tell. Maybe we got you disoriented, but the water came out of the bay here, you know, and washed all these tires that were stuck here and other things all the way across over there. There's the highway through the on the other side of that house. So that's where all the tires went through there. We got them back where they belong now. Okay. Oh man. <laughs> We're gonna throw this in my truck. Okay. <laughs> well the lift came in handy, huh? <laughs> uh. That was the only car here and it was up. So good on that. <laughs> yeah. 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 All he needed was three legs. <laughs> yeah. Look, he picked his uh, steam cleaner. Is that what that is? Yeah. Picked it up with the cherry picker. Got <laughs> it lifted up in the air. Yeah. What time was that? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was bad at that point. I believe you can see right here where the water got up to. So, this house, like I said, is over there and it's got a lot of water in it. We still can't get to it. The water's too high. All right, uh, we need a, uh, one of those squeegee brooms or a broom. Oh, is it good? <laughs> oh, we can get to work now. <laughs> I 
feel like they're uh, they're planning on us working longer. <laughs> <laughs> What's, what exactly is the plan here? You gonna step on? You gonna stand on this board? Here, we gonna, we gonna just put uh, we gonna put Johnson on these boards. He gonna carry around. He gonna pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, show him your uh, your jacket. But I said I could only wear it if I showed it off. <laughs> <laughs> Looks good on you. All right, so we're going that after. We're gonna try to get down to Bo and Caitlin's house. We're gonna try. With kayaks to get baby formula. Baby formula. All right, that's the plan. lenny has gotta eat. Yeah. Was it on the porch? That's what the delivery Oh goodness. It could be anywhere. All right, so the formula had been delivered and was on the porch. And what? And the squeezy. Oh, for the sweeping. Yeah, I got you. No, you can walk it if you were. You know, if you were brave. Mm-mm-mm. There is a house down here, believe it or not. Yeah. Looking for alligators? Yeah. Good. Oh boy. Hey. Oh, is that us? What? Oh yeah, over here. There it is. My goodness. Good thing the race car wasn't in the, the little garage. It's definitely went down a good bit though. Yeah. From that picture that yeah, hey, the there's a boat. We'll just hop on that. We got yeah. the keys in it. Hey, look, a uh, uh, a rake. A um, bunch of uh, hose oh, right here. Yeah. Looks like there's some kind of is that a, maybe chair? a chair. Back of a chair. No, it looks like a chair. There's a chair there. So it's gone down considerably. Yeah, no doubt. Earlier, you could see just the top of that. There's a bunch of stuff right there. Yeah. Maybe a box or something. Is that it? All right. Oh, there's more? Oh, good Lord. Found one of five. <laughs> Two, five. Oh my gosh. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Four or five. Four. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good at that. Are you ready to get out of here? Yeah. All right. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, we got what we need then. All right, so Gatlin found four out of the five things of baby food for Lenny. Y'all can see uh, where the leaves stop. That's where the water got up to. Bo said there was a foot of water in the house. My goodness. Yeah, there was a boat. Got anything done? No. <laughs> Just got around on yeah, that. looks good. Looks a lot better than it did. Yeah. We got the baby formula. Four, uh, four out of five packets of it. They were scattered all over the yard. It looks a lot better in here too. Almost like as soon as it dries up, it'll be ready for a race car or two. <laughs> you all right? <laughs> You waddling. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're going to um to eat some Mexican at the Mexican restaurant. Everybody good? We're good. Alright, we got Bo cleaned up a little bit. Good. 
No. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't see it. I flew off earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the wind will blow it back down. <laughs> Let's go eat. All right, y'all. We have fast forwarded a day. It is now Thursday, the day after all the other events you have seen in the video. The day after uh, the hurricane came through. Watch it. Watch I it. Wanted to... <laughs> Stop it. I wanted to bring y'all in here so I could give y'all an update on our racing plans coming up. And then I also wanted to let you know, we had a lot of people messaging us and commenting, asking how they could help out Bo and his family. Bo didn't, uh, didn't have insurance there on his home, so he's going to be out of pocket trying to get his home back together, get his family uh, there back um, in their house. I want to help him out. The Slay family has set up a GoFundMe uh, where you can contribute. Like I said, a lot of people asked how to help. That was the easiest way that uh, that we knew to do it. So Bo's a tough guy. Um, he'll work hard, get his family uh, back in the home, get back on his feet. But if y'all wanted to contribute and help them, uh, the GoFundMe link will be in the description of this video. Some of the funds there will also go to some of the people around Bo, some members of the community who uh, also had water in their home. So uh, thanks to everyone um, uh, who has already reached out to let us know and to let Bo know that you were thinking and praying for them. And then thank you also to everyone uh, who uh, contributes. Racing plans. We're gonna be taking this car right here to Magnolia Motor Speedway. That's not this weekend, that is next weekend. So no racing this weekend, but the Cotton Picking, uh, Cotton Picking 100 is coming up September 25th, 26th, Magnolia Motor Speedway, Columbus, Mississippi. We're gonna be going back up there with the 10 car. Joseph will be running super late model. There'll be a lot of tough competition there. So uh, y'all stay tuned for that. We got a lot of work to do here, cleaning up. As y'all can see, uh, Joseph and Jesse's yards look a lot like mine and uh, they don't have power either. So luckily I have power here, but, and so I'm able to get y'all videos. But anyway, um, thank y'all for watching. Remember the link to the GoFundMe for Bo is in the description and uh, we're gonna get back to work watching this car. See y'all.